Hey guys, it's Lemon here and welcome back to another Wild Horse Islands video. So today I'm going to be telling you guys the best way that you can earn spring butterflies in Wild Horse Islands and what the best route is. So basically, the two ways to earn these spring butterflies is either finding them on Forest Island or Mainland. Also, sorry, there is a third island. I forgot about this one since it's new to this year's event, but you can also find spring butterflies on Wild Island. They will just spawn and look like little butterflies. Now the question is, forest island or mainland, which one is better to go to? And from my personal experience, both are pretty good, although I do prefer forest island simply because it's smaller and you can really do a better route um, and a lot of the butterflies are more condensed and it's just easier and quicker to do run-throughs of, so that's why I recommend forest. You can basically just do a loop all around the edges of Forest Island and then of course go off track if you see spring butterflies other ways. Um, let me just go ahead and show you guys what I mean. So I usually start along here, run, there's a butterfly, go ahead and grab that because these you can also just run into. Oftentimes I'll also stop and catch the horses because it's another good way that you can just do event horse hunting while grinding is just catch any of the horses that spawn on Forest Island, so I find that that is a great way. Now also, if you're in a private server, it does take a few minutes for these spring butterflies to spawn in, so you might have to wait a bit until um, the spring butterflies become very like abundant, um, but they will come in. I know if I do a couple laps around, eventually there'll just be so many spring butterflies spawning in and they're just all over the place, um, so it makes it really, really easy to grind and and I absolutely love it. And then in addition to earning spring butterflies, I am a big multitasker. So I will also often like just chop down trees and resources to try and earn spring event tokens. And then I'll also stop and care for my horse. For example, Lightning here needs his hose picked. I'll go ahead and care for my horse while doing these runs just to earn a bit of extra event tokens as I'm going around. Um, grinding trees and butterflies and just going all over the place. I'm not going to stop and catch the horses this time um, just because, you know, it kind of takes a little bit to do so, but I do normally stop and catch the horses. Here's some more spring butterflies. We'll go ahead and do this. But generally they stay in one spot, which is good. I know for the souls for Halloween uh, was pretty similar to this, except they would move around, so you kind of have to go and follow them and find them but this you can just go in a nice easy loop so he'll usually loop around here and then once again usually more spring butterflies will <laughs> spawn in than this usually there's even more than this for example right here look you can see like one two over here and then there's a third one right here all right there and then it's also helpful to have a horse with a bunch of stamina so then you can easily just once again loop around but i would say that that is the fastest way to earn spring butterflies i did this i did play this event last year and i did the same exact loop and it was very very effective in earning lots of spring butterflies quickly so go to forest island and just make your way around the edge and get as many spring butterflies as you can that is what i would recommend uh be sure to chop down resources so that you can earn uh spring event tokens same thing with carrying with your horses and then catch those horses too so that you can event horse hunt a lot of multitasking here but i highly recommend so anyways that's all that i have for this video i hope that it helped you guys out and i wish you all luck in your spring event grinding goodbye everybody